So uh, I have a, a stone green that I created using uh, green and white, and then I tipped it with uh, like an ultramarine blue. And I want to create that uh, type of mountain that we see in China. That's called a karst mountain. And I've got very absorbent paper here. And to do that, I have my tip facing away from me. I'm going to start at the top of that mountain peak and work my way down. And I'm going to have um, moisture all the way through. So I don't want my brush to be vertical at all. It's gonna be horizontal. And I'm gonna roll out. See my fingers moving, I'm rolling this out. And the tip of my brush, I want to stay right there. We're going to come back up to the top of the mountain and again leading with that tip painting the rest of that mountain shape now it's lost a little bit of that banana shape on the edge I'm going to load it back up. Here's my palette. It's green. Don't want to get it too wet. Get rid of some of the extra moisture. Dip the tip in that blue. And paint the other side of the mountain. Widening it if I have to. Okay. I can put another layer in it on the tip if I say, oh, that's not um, as deep as I wanted it. I'm just put a tiny bit on my tip. Here's my blue. Keeping the brush, the rest of the brush free of water free of any moisture, dipping it into just the blue. See, can you see that? Just the blue, getting rid of all the extra moisture. Coming back to the top. And while it's wet, remember we have, um, this is um, absorbent paper. Come in with a shaky brush and finish off that. Okay. I like this look here. I want to accentuate it. So I'm going to take my clear brush and stamp. Come in here and coax it out. Mm -hmm. Create that look. 
And while it's still, while this is damp, I can um, come back in and add some more to it. I can create another layer. Like that too, okay? So this is double loading, right? Green and blue for the mountains that are farther in the background. I just want to have only blue because that's what the eye can see. And that blue is going to be very, very um, muted. So I'll take my blue color and it's going to be dilute. Right, watery. It's going to load it up to still get rid of extra moisture. And this time, start with an upright brush because I want to get this upside down V shape. Come behind here. Straight up. And Flatten my brush. Up on the tip. Okay. Again, when I'm ready to make my next peak, flatten the brush. Come up horizontal. All the bristles are down. And then up. You see that? Okay. I want my mountains to be a little greenish. Flat. I can do a side stroke over here. This time my brush is this way. Side stroke to make a, a flatter top. These are pointed, these are flat. This could be like an island. They're a peninsula. Okay. 